Hi folks, this is all the fruit. I'm in the area of Heidelberg, known as Hancho Seiberfeld. And I already told you that here we have a lot of little fruited veg farms, which mostly produce fruits, vegetables, flowers, trees, and you name it for the local market. So you will hardly find the local produce of Heidelberg in big supermarket chains. You will find it either in small shops in Heidelberg or in posh university and hospital canteens, or a lot of it is being sold on the local farm shops. So this is the shop of the Schlicksup farm, one of the bigger fruit and veg shops here in Hanschosheim in Heidelberg. Now let's see what they have. I made a separate video about the tomatoes. I counted 33 tomato varieties just on those two stalls here. They also have a lot of different plums right now. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five different plums are ripe. They still have cherries. They have peaches. They have corn. They have carentes, melons, fusales, or a lantern cherry, cucumbers, apples, tomatoes, basil. I don't even know if they produce their basil themselves. A lot of plants. I'm not really sure if they produce them all themselves. Maybe they are buying some from other farms or from bigger shops. Here, a lot of little plants for your garden. Cabbage, fennel, onions, strawberries. Uh, what is this? Pok choy, different lettuces, fig trees. Lots and lots of garden herbs. Oh, this must be the button flower or the Szechuan pepper. Interesting, I've never seen this for sale in Germany. So here they have a lot of preserves, I guess a lot of them. It says homemade. Yes, homemade by Schlick soup vegetables. Homemade applesauce and other homemade preserves by Schlick soup. Here's some more vegetables. Flowers, some of them are artichoke and sunflower flowers. Well, I don't know if all this vinegar and oil is from here. As I said, they, they are buying some things from other farms and other shops. But I guess that they have a better quality control than some of the big industrialized supermarkets. Well, the noodles, I also guess that they are not from their own farm. But the walnuts probably are. And also most of those berries, I'm pretty sure. Some eggs, which are most probably also local production. Some meat, yeah, we also have some small meat farms in the area. Pretty sure that most of the vegetables are from the Schnicksup farm. Maybe not the lemongrass, they say it's from Thailand. Mushrooms, well, from Germany, but probably not from this farm. Here some packaged cheese and, uh, and milk. But I'm pretty sure that a lot of the onions are from here. Well, I guess that the bananas and, and mangoes are not from here, but the current here it says Eigenes Erzeugnis, that means their own production. So this is from their own farm. Here, Ausländisches Erzeugnis means uh, production from abroad. Deutsches Erzeugnis means it's from Germany. So most of those fruit are not from Germany, as you can see. They even mark it in red so that nobody can really claim that they are trying to sell you other people's stuff as their own. But if it's their own production from their own farm, they write it here. Lots of apples, most of them from Germany. Here, some potatoes, also from their own farm. A lot of different potatoes from their own farm. Look how many different potatoes they are producing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine different potato varieties and they are all from their own farm. Not bad. Only the sweet potatoes are from America. 
here. Yeah, most of the vegetables are German and the beets are even from their own farm. So folks, this was only one of the many great uh, fruit and veg and mostly local produce shops in the Ancho Seiberfeld. This one was from the Schlicksup farm. So thumbs up to Mr. Schlicksup for giving me the permit to film in his shop. Stay tuned for a lot more fruit videos from the farms and gardens of Heidelberg. If you visit Heidelberg, go to the Ancho Seiberfeld and buy some stuff in the local farm shops us helping and supporting the small local farms over the big international chains yeah and most important of all don't forget to like share comment and subscribe